What's going on guys? Uh, this year I'm finally taking the time to build this channel up so I figured I'd start off with an impromptu overview of my uh, deer hunting setup this year. I've uh, got a Matthews V331 at 70 pounds, 28 and a half inch draw. I'm running gas strings and I've got a Bowmore nose button I just got it put on. Uh, a buddy of mine that shoots very well that I, I talk to almost daily about deer hunting, bow hunting, and uh, he shoots great. And he turned me on to that nose button and said that it helped him stay in his shot and it just helped his, his anchor every time. And so far I like it. I've shot it quite a bit since I got it and I do enjoy it. I'm running B stingers. Uh, I do have a back stabilizer on here. Uh, haven't made my mind up, I'm gonna keep it. It does add a little bit of weight to the bow, but I do, I do like it. I'm running an Axel single pin sight. I've had this sight for a couple of years now and I love it. I killed a 145 inch deer in Arkansas with it this year. And just, I have another single pin, but this one's very user friendly and it stays rock solid where you want it. Uh, the, it's not so big that you can't see anything at low light but it's big enough you can see it if that makes sense and you can hold it where you need to hold it and pull it through and execute your shot very well with it my arrow setup is i'm running a vap ss which is a stainless steel and carbon weaved arrow with a aae max 23 which is a low profile vein but i'm running a pretty good helix on it if you can see that shooting a muzzy hybrid so I need those veins on there to you know you really if your your bow is tuned well you don't have to worry about much for your you don't want to rely on your veins to uh, steer your broadhead but I got it tuned up and they're shooting very well I haven't calculated exactly my four to center but just from eyeballing it it's between a 12 and a 15 percent and then I'm shooting was 282 feet per second with a 460 grain arrow. So it it's not as heavy as some other people's arrows, but I still got the speed there. And with this VAP, this VAP penetrates very well. So I have no doubt that I can get through any deer I need to get through. And let me know what y'all set up are. I, I really, I'm enjoying shooting with this. I'm, Switch to a Thermalise this year. I'm shooting a knock to it by Dudley. They're made by Carter. And I just I got a silverback order that I'm probably gonna hunt with the beginning of season for sure, just so I make sure when I pull through, I'm executing that shot perfectly and I'm not punching it. Cause I know as soon as 160 inch deer walks in front of me, I'm gonna want to punch this trigger. But uh, y'all let me know and good luck this season. Y'all stay pure, y'all stay elite, y'all stay unguided. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Thank you.